the Mason Minute with Kevin Mason. The other day, the U.S. Postal Service announced the new stamps that were coming out, the new designs that were coming out for 2024. And it took me back to a day when, gosh, I was probably, what, 12, 13 years old. I collected stamps, and I got into it pretty heavily for a brief time. But I thought, does anybody collect stamps anymore? There used to be stamp collector shops in malls, just like coin collector shops. You don't see those anymore. I don't even know if it's a thing anymore. Since the Forever Stamp came out, stamps, there aren't as many of them. Prices, while they do raise, they don't look any different. The Forever Stamp doesn't have a price on it, so the same stamp no matter what the price is. That was the one thing about stamps. You could have a six cent stamp or an eight cent or 10 cent or 25 or whatever we're up to now, 50, 60. I don't even know what we're paying anymore. I got my forever stamp sitting here and I only use one or two a month. I don't mail anything anymore. But it's interesting, a hobby that was so big and so popular for so many years. I had so many people giving me stamps and helping me out and stamps from all around the world. It's kind of sad to me. Something that was so cool and so interesting, thanks to the world we live in, isn't quite as cool as it used to be.